Enter for a chance to win a big box of crayons, a set of watercolors, and an artist's pad of paper. Send pictures to refrigerator123 at gmail.com. Every picture is an entry, so the more pictures you send, the more of a chance you have to win. Hi everyone, welcome back to The Refrigerator. This is going to be our last week together, so I'm really happy you're here. Today's story is about families. We've been spending a lot of time with our families lately, and I thought it'd be special for us to read about a family. This story is called, A Family is a Family is a Family. We were talking about families at school. The teacher asked us what we thought made our family special. I went last because I wasn't sure what to say. My family is not like everybody else's. My mom and dad have been best friends since first grade. They really like each other. It's kind of gross. There are lots of kids in our family. Mom and dad just keep bringing home, coming home with more. Both my moms are terrible singers and they both like to sing really loud. I have more grandparents than anyone else I know. We have a new baby in our house. I think my mom ordered him online. We all look alike in my family. We just kind of go together. One week, mom gets me, the next week, dad does. Fair is fair. Some people say I look like my dad, and some people say I look like my mom. I think I look like myself. My mom says that before I was born, I grew in her heart. Because I live with my grandmother, people sometimes think that she's my mom. She's not. She's my everything. Some of the kids were dads when he met mom. Some were moms when she met dad. Now we all belong to each other. One of my dads is tall and one is short. They both give very good hugs. I listen to everybody else. And then I remembered the time someone saw us all together at the park. She asked my foster mother to point out her real children. Oh, I don't have any imaginary children, my mom said. All my children are real. A family is a family is a family. Let's get out our pencils and draw our family. All right, my friends. We are going to draw our families. Now your family is going to look a little bit different than my family and maybe a little bit different from your friend's families and that's okay. Just like the story said, all families are just the way they're supposed to be. So I'm going to draw my family. I'll show you kind of how to draw a person and then you can add the different details that make your family special. I'm going to start with myself. I'm going to draw a circle for my head. And then I'm going to draw a rectangle with curved sides to, and corners to make sure that it looks kind of like a shirt. I'm going to give myself a pair of jeans. And some shoes. some sleeves on my shirt and then from my sleeves my arms I'm gonna put my hands on my hips now I'm going to add my hair which has little curls at the end and for my eyes I'm going to put two dots And for my mouth, I'm going to draw a straight line with a curved line under it. And then I'm going to add the detail of my glasses. 
All right. Now I'm going to draw my husband who's a little bit taller than me and he has different features and de details that make him special. He's got some curly hair on the top of his head. He's got glasses and some facial hair. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw him as well. All right, now I'm going to draw our baby and she is uh, a little one-year-old, so she's really short. And I'm gonna draw her with her little hair sticking up and a bow. That's my family. I'm gonna get out my marker and do some tracing. All right, now I'm gonna color my family. paint my background um, with my watercolors. All right guys, here's my family. I can't wait to see your family and your drawing. We send them in. See you guys next time. Have a good day. Enter for a chance to win a big box of crayons, a set of watercolors, and an artist's pad of paper. Send pictures to refrigerator123 at gmail.com. Every picture is an entry, so the more pictures you send, the more of a chance you have to win.